Heaven Studio. Probably my favorite application that lets you make random Rhythm Heaven games, remixes, whatever you want. But it can be basic sometimes. This is why I'm going to show you how to edit textures or source, whichever one you want to call it, in Heaven Studio. Before we get into the main tutorial, here's some things that you might want to know. I'm doing it the way that I do it. I'm not doing the way that it tells you to do it on GitHub. If you want to do that, you can go to the actual GitHub page and find the actual documentation on how to build the game. I'm not smart enough to follow that. Another thing, you can use this to edit code if you really wanted to, but I don't know the language right now, so I would show that off, but also I feel like people are smart enough to know where the files are and how to use Unity, so yeah. Also, if you have any questions, feel free to leave them down below. Just make sure that the question actually makes sense to ask, because I don't want to be going through things and then questioning my sanity. Another reason why I'm making this tutorial and what you should know, a lot of people have asked how I've made my custom sprites. I really want to share this with people, because I want to see not Karate Joe for the 400th time, I want to see someone different. It just really lights up a remix to have custom textures, and I really want more people to have them inside their remixes. Also, one last thing. If this thing is outdated whatsoever, I'm going to have that plastered over the entire thing. Don't follow it. It's kind of unlikely that it's going to be outdated soon, but like, please make sure you're aware. With all that said, let's go ahead and get straight into this tutorial. So I might have exported the video and forgot to mention you will need Unity and Unity Hub for this. I didn't uninstall them for this tutorial, so you'll just have to do it on your own. The Unity version Heaven Studio uses is 2021.3.21, so download that version. Sorry, back to your normally scheduled Quagsir 3 tutorial. First you're going to go to the Heaven Studio GitHub page that I've linked in the description of the video. You're going to want to go to code and download the zip. This is the source code for Heaven Studio, or basically all the necessary files to compile it to make Heaven Studio. After it's done downloading, make sure you extract the zip because if you don't, it's going to be 10 times more painful for you. Once the file is extracted, you're going to want to go to the file directory on where the sprites are, which is in assets slash resources slash sprites slash games and then just choose any game you want and after you click in the folder you'll see all the PNGs that you want to edit. So as a funny joke to show that you can literally use anything to edit the textures, I decided to use paint just because I thought it'd be funny. Please don't use paint. Please. Just don't. So this is why I was telling you you can't use paint really. It doesn't have PNG support. <laughs> Also, quick side note while I'm doing the peddler's textures, you can find the textures for models inside of the assets slash resources slash models slash games, choose any of the games, and then go to the materials folder and you should be able to find the textures that they use. Once you're done editing whatever you want, go to Unity Hub. Once you're in Unity Hub, open your project file. And then you'd have to wait for everything to load, which I didn't record. Once in Unity, I'd recommend checking your sprites to make sure they all saved correctly. So go to where the sprites are located inside the files, and 
you can see that mine saved, except for this one. It did save, but it is slightly cut off, and that would annoy the hell out of me, so I'd recommend going to the main sprite sheet and then going to the sprite editor. The sprite editor lets you edit the hitboxes. I wouldn't say they're really hitboxes, but the range of where the sprites end and where new sprites start. So you're able to just drag around stuff and fix it to your liking. Once you're done with that, make sure to apply settings, which might take a while. Once you're done checking your textures, you want to go to assets and build the asset bundles. This takes a hot minute, but is required because if you don't do it, everything will just kind of not work. Well, it'll work, it's just it'll look very bad. Once that's done, you're going to want to go to file and build settings. This will put up another window, and you don't have to change anything here, just click build. I accidentally stopped the recording when it was building, so no time lapse for you, haha. <laughs> Once it's done building, it'll open File Explorer, you're free to close Unity, and you're free to open HeavenStudio.exe. So, I had like 5 minutes of me screwing around with the sprites that I made inside of Heaven Studio for this part, but I decided it'd be funnier to make a custom remix, so uh, just take a look. I apologize if your eyes or ears need a break after that.